Welcome back, Smooth and Crypto. I'm your host, Maxwell Smooth. It is day 94 in Titan X, and it looks like we found a bottom. I mean, this past week or so, it has been trending sideways. I mean, it's been trending sideways for quite a while now, but it's day 94. Everybody relax. We are going to see mass adoption here in the future. We have one project being built on top of, top of Titan X, and we have 15 other 16 other projects being built right we have such a long way to go and it'll, it is only day 94 the daily update's going to keep doing its thing for a couple thousand days right um so let's just get into some stats estimated tight next at the end of a miner is 1.202 billion so today is the last day that it will be in 1.2 billion for the end of a a max miner ETH to start a miner is 0.2154 Ethereum, roughly $498. Uh, market value at the end of a miner is 1275, and that is at current price. So if it goes up 100%, this, this is doubled. If it drops by 50%, this is halved. So keep in mind that 156% uh, for ROI at the end. So this is still get your money back plus. A 2.5. So, I mean, it's still very good. This is general. This is a 2.5 X. Everybody remember 156% is get your money back plus 156%. So this is a very good percentage still, in my opinion, Titan X, uh, it's five zeros, one zero, six zero. So we have dropped a zero and it looks like we have, uh, and we will continue to stay above that. I mean, obviously no one knows what's going to happen, but the, Overall theme is sideways slash it's going slowly up. So a lot less miners are getting uh, released. And with people not really having their miners coming out, especially uh, short-term miners being less profitable, this, pro this price is way less volatile than it was. So day 94, uh, hopefully we found the local bottom, but who knows, right? Curtain type current titan per day of mining is 5.774 million so we are slowly dropping early adoption amplifier is at 7.34 percent so get in while you can if if you want to get in right uh payouts we have 150,000 in the eight day 221,000 in the 28 day uh 77,000 in the 90 day we have 5.6 million in the 369 day and then 2.5 million in the 888 day. So very good. We're still growing. Uh, even with the you know lowest amount of miners coming in, we still have a decent amount of uh, dollars in the payouts. Uh, buy and burn sitting at 14 million for the V2, 10.3 million for the V1. Very healthy. I mean, we've been at this for damn near a month now. So uh, still... 3.33 ETH callable every 60 minutes. And if we go over to the buy and burn, right, with these low prices, this thing's been eating about the same amount every single day, which is awesome. I am I really like that. And although it was turned up like crazy during this time, uh, you know, doing millions of dollars per day, this is way more stable. And especially since we have way less miners being released, and being sold during this time, this is a lot more healthy than how we were up here. If we were burning this many, this much dollars for uh, while while not a lot of miners are coming out, this would be making the price go crazy. But at the same time, that will just make sell pressure even crazier. So I, I would personally rather a slow, gradual increase, a general $2,000, $200,000 every single day being bought and burned because that's what it seems like uh, we're getting every single day into our buy and burn. So it's creating a way more stable project, which I very much like. And five zeros is still a very cheap project. So, you know, if we drop some zeros, that's that's a lot of X's. So I'm still very excited. Um, and a new update to the stats, it is the BOT protocol. So bot protocols, I'm just going to call it for short. So this is total number of liquid Titan X semi locked inside of quote unquote build on type build on Titan X. So this is in the Titan X slash protocol liquidity pool and or 
inside of build on Titan X decentralized smart contracts. So this is all of the protocols that are being built on top of Titan X and how much coins they are actually taking in, either holding or uh, wrapped in their liquidity pool. So this is a very awesome thing that was added to the website. It just shows uh, the type of adoption that these projects are actually getting. And if we can see this, right? I mean, obviously, uh, the only ones we have, right, is Dragon X, and we also have an NFT one. So with those, it's $447,000 has already been added to this. So 421 billion tokens, which is mind blowing, right? Mind blowing. And this is just the start. And we have a ton of projects uh, going to be released. And this is going to be an insane run. So I'm really, really excited for this and, and looking forward to, you know, what we're what we're going to do. Um, liquid amount is almost 20 percent so still a lot of sell pressure and uh liquid coming out uh yet again i still think a lot of this is for hyper but nonetheless we still have a lot staked and the still the buy and burn is still doing its thing so 15.5 trillion tokens is being bought and burned so roughly 16.42 million dollars but the crazy thing is, if we 2x from here, right, this is almost uh, $33 million worth of buy and burn, which is insane to me, right? And if we 2x, if we go back to the buy and burn, this is $28 million and this is 10, I mean, $20 million. So with the 2x, right, we're sitting on what, 40, so this is 24 48 million dollars worth of buy and burn if we forex from here we have a hundred million dollars sitting in our buy and burn which is insane to me insane um with ethereum uh pushing up so so go back to stats so we have a lot of great stats and this is just a a great thing to add and i love the neon green that has been used to put in this and we'll see we'll continue to see this this grow and i'm really excited for this piece of pie to continue to grow and eat up a lot of the titan x and it seems like it's going to but you know we'll see uh time will tell so we have officially passed 258,000 miners uh roughly 13,318 people so in the past day 120 people have joined which is awesome uh, and I will always say it, slow growth is better than no growth, in my opinion. So uh, looking forward to it. We've been kind of roughly at that 100 uh, miners per day started, right? Obviously, after the day 90, we had a nice little pump of miners. Every single time we have a payout, we have a big thing of miners coming out. Uh, miners started, I should say. So really like that. Really looking forward to it. Um, still a ton of ETH is being bought every single day. Even on our low day, we're still getting, you know, 30 ETH, right? 47 ETH, 436 ETH. So we have a ton of ETH rolling in and out of this. And as you can see, we're on a nice downward trend on how much inflation we have coming out. So I'm excited to see this is lining up perfectly. Not a lot of miners coming out, so not a lot of inflation uh, comparatively to what we did have, right? So low inflation, comparatively, low inflation, more projects being coming coming out, a stable buy and burn, and the daily update is continuing to do its thing. So every day that passes, it is, it is much better to do it the day before for the daily update for miners. And people realize that once we start really pushing up uh not only in price but the amount of coins that uh is being taken off by all these projects and you know it's a really good thing to uh get into some of these other projects right i like having fresh powder for them although i think you know having a one-to-one -one ratio or something like that is a really good uh aspect but fresh powder i i like Fresh powder for every type of investment I do. Um, I don't like to take other people, my other coins to go into other people's projects, but that is just me. But, you know, 
it is what it is. Um, so we're still burning about the same amount, which is awesome. And nonetheless, slow growth is better than no growth. And every day we have more people than yesterday. And every day we have more miners started than yesterday. So I'm really looking forward to it. Um, Dragon X has been absolutely crushing it, right? So current supply of Dragon X is three trillion. And if you didn't know, after the twelve, uh, after the twelve weeks, it'll be completely deflationary. So they have a ton of uh, ETH in here, and they have total. Th their main goal is to take as many Titan X off of the market as possible, which I really like. And they're going to be buying and burning not only Dragon X, but also Titan X. So I'm really looking forward to it. They got a lot of great things going on. And uh, yeah, so current price of Dragon X is just a tad bit more than uh, Titan X. So it's going to be interesting to see where we go from here. Um, uh, I know that uh, when in my live stream, Jake was very excited about a lot of these projects. And, you know, he's going to do some some in-depth analysis during these live streams about these projects. So whether he does it publicly or on the live streams, he is definitely has his eye on what we're doing, what other people are doing on Twitter, right? He is everywhere with where he, where he's viewing. And I just love the fact that he's open to uh, talk about uh, other projects, right? I, I know that he was worried about giving light to other projects based on you know he doesn't know if they're you know going to be solid or the you know he never you never know what's going to happen on new projects and the fact that any of these codes really work and i'm just glad that the audits that jake put out uh were were done correctly and you know these guys were some some big ballers when it comes to doing the audits and you know Titan X has been running perfectly and the daily update will continue to just eat away, eat away, eat away. And the fact that we're, you know, typically found a, a bottom is pretty, pretty impressive. In my opinion, we have a ton of bullishness in the future. We're only at five zeros, one zero six. So we have a ton of upward uh, movability, right? We, we're still a very low market cap coin. We still have only 13,000 people in the protocol. Once we have a couple green monthly candles, this project is going to go absolutely ballistic, right? Once we have these projects being released, it, this is what it takes for a project to go nuts. And if everything has the main LP pair to tight necks, we are going to be just fine. Wait till this daily update eats away and i know it's hard to believe that i'm 2000 3000 days out in my horizon for where i think this project's going to go i think it's not going to be a straight up line over those uh you know over those 2 3000 days and it and it never will be but it's going to be an awesome ride i'm very very appreciative of being in this project the community is great i'm looking forward to this this long uh real grind that we're going to have right but these projects that are being released are going to be super sweet so i'm really excited let me know what you guys think in the comments i uh, appreciate everybody make sure you subscribe to the channel we're almost at 2000 subscribers so if you're watching this video right now and you're not subscribed just hit your hit that subscribe button it doesn't take too much time it takes one second and it helps me out greatly so i appreciate everybody for watching viewing and subscribing Comment below what your favorite part of the live stream was. And if you didn't see the live stream, go click on that video with Jake Sharp. Jake Sharp absolutely crushed the live stream. We talked for an hour and 40 minutes and it it was effortless, right? It was a great time. I had, you know, the chat was going nuts, right? And we're going to do more in the future. So hit that subscribe button. I appreciate everybody. Peace.